Doug Lamarie at the Woody Hayes Athletic Center. Just talked to Urban Meyer on Monday as the Buckeyes get ready for the Big Ten Championship game against Northwestern on Saturday. And here's something I think that matters for Ohio State at this point in the season, 12 games in. I think they've figured out some depth. And at a couple key places, they've they've had a couple guys move in and out. We've seen Brendan White emerge as the safety next to Jordan Fuller. We've seen Tuff Borland kind of lock down that middle linebacker job, but Baron Browning is back now. They had some different defensive looks on the defensive line last week. They were playing Draymond Jones on the edge. Jonathan Cooper had a really good game, though, along with Chase Young. Teron Vincent, as a freshman, is working defensive tackle on some third down looks. They have a lot of guys they're running in on the defensive line. We've seen Chris Olave get in the rotation at receiver with Austin Mack out. They have six guys they still trust there. They have a couple different tight ends. I think this team, over time, with some moving pieces, has reached the point where when they have an injury like they have now with Demetrius Knox out for the year with the foot injury, they're sliding in Wyatt Davis, they slid in Chris Olave, and they have backups who are making a difference for this team. I've written and talked a lot about these 2017 and 2018 classes that were both ranked number two in the country. Not a ton of guys all over the field right now, but there's a couple guys I think in the second level, the second team that are ready to help Ohio State with that. I think Wyatt Davis is going to show that with Demetrius Knox. A couple weeks ago, Urban Meyer said they didn't know where their depth was on the offensive line, but now Brandon Bowen is back healthy. Josh Allaby has played well when Thayer Munford went out against Maryland. He went in at left tackle. Wyatt Davis is ready. Urban Meyer said Josh Myers, like Davis, a redshirt freshman, is ready if needed. They have reached the point where they don't just have their top guys, they have the next level of guys behind them. You don't want injuries this late in the year, but I think Ohio State, through 12 games, has sort of filled out its roster, has developed some of these young guys. Urban Meyer likes what they're doing on special teams. I think Ohio State has the depth it needs that if something goes wrong against Northwestern, if something goes wrong, if they wind up in the playoff and something happens in bowl practice, I think this team can withstand it much more than they could earlier in the year. They're at the point, I think, where they've worked out the 22 starters, but they also have more guys behind them they can rely on. That matters when you have an injury like Demetrius Knox. Much more coverage coming this week at Cleveland.com. Again, the Big Ten Championship game Saturday night in Indianapolis, Ohio State versus Northwestern. We'll be there. Thanks for watching.